Hello, Heart Dwellers family. I'm sharing with you one of my conversations with the Lord. I began, Dear Lord, I think I have just made a mistake here. I made a decision without informing my superiors. Can you help me to clear up this problem? So I wanted to help a brother in need, and I hope it does not backfire me. Please help me, Father. Jesus began, I will turn all your concerns into streams of living water. Like calm water, do not be afraid, but have faith that I can turn all bad situations into good. Be very careful of the traps set before you by your enemy. He will employ all means necessary to stop you on the path I'm leading you. Thank you, Jesus. I know you are faithful. But sometimes I forget your, your character. Help me, Jesus, always to remember your goodness and not have the image of a serious and harsh God in my head. Jesus said, I love you. I am meek and humble. I am gentle with my creation. And I am only a fierce judge to those who oppose my will. Come and sit with me. I created all for you, for your joy. I created you to abide in the temple of my heart and to share in my divinity as a priest adorer. How could I not love and care for you? The image you have reflects the fear people have for me. They think that I am a demanding. No, I am, I am meek and humble of heart. I like to be involved in your daily activities. Call me and let's do everything together. I am not a distant God. I am so near to you and all my sons. Share with me your worries, your future plans, your anxiety, and let's deal with them one by one. I am your God and your faithful friend. Do not be afraid. Trust in my, provi my providence and my capacity to change the events of your life for the better. Thank you, Jesus. And that was the end of the message. And guys, after some days, he gave me the ideas and the situation just <clears throat> resolved by itself. Yeah, without any effort. So, this is to encourage you to go to Jesus whenever you feel you have a situation in your life. Don't be afraid. Don't hold back. Go to Jesus. See you until the next conversation.